Are you saying you think it was an accident? Yes, well, of course it was an accident. Why, the look. Oh. What, what if it's not? What if someone's out to get you? That's what Lucas said. Somebody's out to get Devons. Why not? Because it's ridiculous. It's not ridiculous. It's the only thing that makes any sense anymore. Maybe you just don't want to believe it. Macy can be really mean if he thinks somebody's going behind his back. Oh, Lucas, come on. OK, I do not want to lose this place. It's going to be mine in another six months. I'll own it free and clear. And Macy won't be able to touch me. Damn it, Sage, already two people dead. You really want to wait and take a body count six months from now? Someone deliberately set that explosion. I mean, who? Who would do that? Well, I know one person. Roberto. He just got out of prison, and you're the reason he was there. So he's going to do something that'll put his ass back in prison? I don't think so. I'm not buying that. Roberto may, may want to settle a score with me, but he's not stupid. Exactly. He knows how to cover his tracks. He knows how to make things seem like an accident. Maybe like the car crash. Are you exchanging fantasies with Lucas? I think Lucas is on the right track. I don't think any of this is a coincidence. What I don't understand is how you don't feel the same way. I'm not dismissing anything. Then keep an open mind. Stefan is dead. You owe it to him to find out what really happened. You're acting like you don't even care, like it doesn't even matter. Oh, let's just get back to business as usual. I never said that. You didn't have to. Excuse me, I need some air. taking the news about Stefan very hard, isn't she? <laughs> I'm surprised you showed up. What? I'm not scared of you. You're not afraid of losing to a girl? Again? <laughs> well, let's see if you walk as good as you talk. Ooh, look at the nerd reading a book. So, wear your glasses, nerd. If I'm a nerd, then what the hell are you two? Oh, come on. Come hang out with the cool kids and play some pool. Oh, I gotta go in a minute. Oh, come on. Stay and play. What could you possibly have to do that I can't wait? I'll see you guys later. 
Wait, where are you going? I promised Ione I would take her to the mall. Okay, well, we'll come. No, 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 you guys stay here. Have fun. Anyway, Ione likes to hunt alone in her own natural environment. You know, I love that girl, but I swear sometimes she's from another planet. This? Look, we had a little setback, okay? With the dead girl, I didn't want to push the trade. Hey, you fooling with the powder, Jimmy Ray? Look, I'm just getting a cold, okay? Make sure you keep the revenue up, so Roberto won't get suspicious. Oh, Pop, don't worry, okay? it'll be better next week. I got a new client, real classy. The big spender, too. I'm glad you're home. Mother? You don't sound too well. Are you okay? No, I'm not. Right, well, right. well have, have a good flight, Will. And call me when you get in. I'll have the limo waiting. And nothing to the press, understand? Good man. We definitely need to do some damage control. The press announcements for the Millennia promotion already were sent. Well, I'm waiting on a call back from the attorneys. We're going ahead, aren't we? That's my plan. I'm going to talk to Will as soon as he lands. Oh. Macy is a bit unraveled. That's because of the contest. Do you blame him? Catherine, the Devon family is a team. Macy knows that. We all pull together for the good of the business. He feels that you're ignoring all that he's done over the years. Well, I'm not doing that. He thinks that you're squeezing him out. Are you? I just wanted to give him and Lucas an equal chance. I'm surprised you're not in favor of that. Well, I am. I think it would be good for Lucas. Macy, on the other hand, has a tendency to overstep. <laughs> I wonder where he gets that from. Hmm. Is Anne still in her room? Yes. She's very upset about Stefan. As we all are. Yes. They had a very close relationship. I'm sure she's inconsolable. The right we will want certain insurances. So will I. When the smoke clears, I want to be the only man standing. There could be some downward spiral now because of the death of explosion. 
that's even better. It means Martin's little contest will bite the dust. You think he's gonna put you in charge? Well, who else is gonna keep the ball rolling? Really? Yeah, I'd say that uh, explosion at DevTech was <laughs> quite the little gift horse for me. What about our operation? We're, uh, we're gonna have to lay low for a little while. Yeah, I know. Just, just until I can clean up our trail a bit, and then, then we'll resume business as usual. I promise. You know, Roberto's gonna control the port soon. That means we could triple our take. Greedy, 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 Manny. I love you. You gotta learn to be patient. And have a little faith. What about your brother? Lucas? Well, I got plans for Lucas. Did I mention they don't include him running Devon Cosmetics? <laughs> 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 My dad doesn't want to believe it, but I'm telling you, there's no way that explosion was an accident. I don't know, Lucas. I mean, a lab like DevTech has to have a lot of combustible material in it. It's just what my father said. You're not buying it. Oh, come on, Ian. I mean, first Bobby dies in a car crash, that's anything but an accident. And then the lab explodes? The very lab that produces the products for Devon Cosmetics, which Bobby headed up. That doesn't make sense. Yeah, you got a point. I'm thinking we need to beef up security around the building and fast. No, I already took care of it. You did? Yeah, oh, cool. Thanks, man. That was, uh, that was a good call. Hey, we can't be too overprotective right now. I mean, just in case. Absolutely, you're right. So, what's the plan? Well, I'm still waiting on a report from my PI. I got working on the car crash. A private investigator. Wow. If this is all connected, which it may be. You think of what I'm thinking? Somebody wants to see the Devons go down. And this could just be the beginning. Merry Christmas. That was my present. <laughs> it's always a pleasure doing business with you, Miss Stone. Gabby, I, I really like for you to come to Miami. What's this about? Honey, I miss you. There's been so much tension between us for so long. I'd like for you to be close again. I'd like that too. Then say you'll come to Miami. I need you here more than ever. You sound so frightened. Are you? Gabby, just say you'll come. Does this have to do with Martin? Not really. We've been having some problems since Bobby's death, but. What kind of problems? It doesn't matter, honey. I don't want too much more time to go by I don't want it to be too late. Too late for what? Too late for us to be mother and daughter again. Like when Jack was alive, do you remember? I remember. Those were the best times of my life. Mine too. Mine too. I really need you here. Who's that? Mother? Mother? Martin? 
That, that was Gabby. I asked her to come to Miami. Oh, that's, uh, that's probably a good idea. I was thinking maybe, maybe we could go out for a little light dinner. I'm really not hungry. I know you're upset about Stefan and Nora. But I think getting out might be easy. I cannot deal with facing people tonight, Martin. I'd like to be alone for a while. Maybe Catherine will join you. Catherine's not my wife. Stefan wasn't your husband. What's that supposed to mean? I think you're being overly upset over someone who was supposedly just a friend. I'm not going to pretend like I didn't hear you say that, Mark. Calling me, sweetness? Gracie, I was just thinking about you. Really? But I'm glad I stopped by. What about what you said the other day? Mm-hmm. You know about us being a team. You're telling me you like the idea? Yeah. Yeah, I am. So you'll help me bury Lucas? I can only handle one problem at a time, and right now Macy's at the top of the list. I mean, he was always jealous of Bobby. Yeah, I gathered that from Bobby. Did he ever say anything more specific? Uh, you know, Bobby, I mean, I never really put a whole lot out there. I did get the distinct impression, however, you didn't trust Macy. God, my mind has been running on overtime ever since this death tech exploded. I don't think Macy had anything to do with this. Who else has a motive to bring down the cosmetics division? I mean, think about it. From where Macy's sitting, that puts him in a major strategic position to take over the company. Your dad wouldn't let that happen, would he? Are you kidding me? If it's between me or Macy to save Devin? Come on, man, what do you think? Lucas, your dad's a pretty smart guy. I don't think he's in the dark about Macy's agenda. I mean, Macy's been saving up brownie points for years now. Look, Ian, you're Bobby's best friend, so I'm trusting you with this. I need you to help me. Yeah. Sure. You, I mean, you have me. Join forces with me. Make sure Macy never gets his hands on this company. Is Anne feeling better? You want to have dinner with me? Oh. Um. Yeah, sure. I I'd love to. When? Ten minutes. Meet me outside. Fine. Will Anne be joining us? No. No. What a shame.
searched the police files and I couldn't come up with anything from 25 years ago. Yeah, we don't keep those records here. That's what I figured. So I went into the police archives and guess what? There's no file on you at all, Commissioner. Isn't that weird? Commissioner, do you or do you not want my help? Very hard before you answer that question. Well, I appreciate the advice, but I think I already answered that. Did you send me that? Got another call from City Hall. I hear you, Cap. All right, I got two men out right now searching down leads. Tommy, I'm not criticizing you. I want to wrap this up as much as you do. Yeah, O'Keefe. Detective, this is Terry Martin from the Allure Agency. You uh, wanted to speak to me? 